this is Pyrrhic, one of the creators of Tiny Tigers. Uh, today we're gonna see how we have made uh, the 10,000 Tiny Tigers with my colleagues. So how do we generate the 10,000 JSON files and how do we upload them on the, on the blockchain Solana. So if you don't know about the Tiny Tigers, uh, this is one of the projects I've been on, my main project right now. So we've been doing this, uh, these Tiny Tigers, these cute Tiny Tigers with a partner of mine and uh, I will just show you how to do it um, using Ashlips method. Uh, so this is a generator, Ashlips Art Engine, that have been uh, used in the Ethereum or Polygon blockchain, but uh, until now it wasn't available for Solana, but Jack Solana has made a huge, huge work to make it available to Solana. So first of all, we have to download uh, Visual Studio Code. Uh, every link will be in the description of this video. So for me, it's a Mac. I just download it on, on the Mac and I open Visual Studio Code. I go to File, New File. Up, oh, we're on there. And Terminal, if it isn't already displaying, I go to Terminal, New Terminal. Once we, we've been here, we need NPM. So to have NPM, just go on the net, install NPM, take the first link and you will install, install NPM on your computer. Um, we're gonna need NPM to install Git. With that, we'll be, we're gonna be able to clone the repo that we have on GitHub. So we go to GitHub, we get the Ashlips Art Engine for Solana, we go to code, copy the code, so CD desktop, just to go to the desktop, to just put the file on the desktop and not directly on my Mac. Desktop, git clone, and here we go. So it just cloned the repo that we have on GitHub and it will help us to generate the 10,000 images and JSON files. It can be kind of fast or it can be slow, it depends on, uh, on your computer. When it will be done, we just go to file Open, go to the desktop, Ashlips Art Engine, and open. Over here, terminal, new terminal, and here we go. We have to go with yarn, yarn install, we have to install all the dependencies that we have on the project. Same then to npm, if you don't have any yarn, just go to Google and write install yarn, which is Y-A-R-N. Once it's done, you just have to go and to see what the generator is about. So we have layers. The layers will be all the different uh, parts that you have on the, on the program. So there is a background, there is a lid, there is eye, eye color. So this is everything that has been used by Ashlips uh, in this video for Ethereum. What do we want here is just to replace the layers by our layers. So this is kind of simple, just suppress what we have. Let's go, just suppress everything. Okay, everything is suppressed. So what are we gonna do? We're just gonna replace what there is right there by our layers. So for me, it will be with my tigers, which is in test file. Test file. I take the different files that I have. I copy them. Go to desktop. We go for Ashlips Art Engine. We are in layers. And we pass them. We replace if we already have a background. So this is mine. Closes, eyes, mouses, tiger, and we just suppress the rest of them. All right, we go back to our code. In the code, you can see now we have background, closes, eyes, 
mouses and tiger uh, what we need to do right there is just to put um, the, the rarity okay so we just rename the different backgrounds we keep the same name but we put the numbers I want it to be 20% blue so it would be the same number 20% same for green I want 40 pink and 24 violet. You do that for everything. Costume maybe 40%. Just remember you have to make it 100 at the end. So 40 and 60 it would be 100%. Right here 20, 20, 40, 20 would be 100% as well. Normalize would be 50 and the great pink glasses would be 50 as well. For the mouses, again 40% and the tongue will appear 60% of the time. For the tiger, the great yellow tiger will be 20%. And the orange one would be so 80%. So we have all the rarity uh, for our different layers, for backgrounds, closes, eyes, masses, and tiger. Once we have the rarities, we have to check in index.js, just there, that we have the same, um, it would be in config.js. Once we have all the rarities, we're going to config.js. And we go and see the the layers order this is very very important because if you have the tiger the background uh, that are the top this is what will be appearing in the last so if you go background first and then tiger you have the tiger on the background if you do tiger then background it will be on the on the wrong way so here we have background you have to name it exactly the name of the file background after background we have Tiger, after Tiger we have Closes, after we have the Eyes, then the Mouse. When you want to put more category, you just copy that and paste it, just after, for us. We just have five categories for this example. Do not forget to go to file and save. If you don't do that, it will not save. So now we want to prepare our JSON files. To prepare our JSON files, we have to make it to the right format for Solana blockchain. So how do we do that? We have to change the collection name. Name of the collection will be the tiny, tiny tigers. symbol of the connection will be I don't know TT for example this is seller fee basis point this is um, the fees that you will get if your if your NFT is sold on the, on the secondary market on the second market so if you want your customers to keep their NFTs and not sell it you can put a high price if you don't want you can just put zero or you can put I don't know 500 by 5% uh, when sold. This is the external URL. Will be It will be used uh, in another video to see how you can implement your NFTs and your mint button on a website. So for now, we just let it like that. Here is very important. There is the layers order that we just saw, but there is also the numbers of NFTs that you want to produce. For here, we want 10,000 NFTs. It would be a bit long, so we just go and put 10 NFTs. So you can see the format of your files. Here it would be 1000 pixels to 1000 pixels. There is a background um, generator. So we already have your, our background, so we don't want them. Just put zero. Very important. Also here, uh, we want 10,000 unique NFTs. So this is the, the constant unique DNA torrents to have 10,000 unique NFTs 
not 1000, not 100, but 10,000. Yeah, write the, the name of your collection. So always, it's, I don't know, Tiny Tiger Collection Family Tiny Jungle. Maybe if we want to say that we have some tigers, some elephants, some other animals. We have to leave image.png here because it will go to arm wave, so do not change that. And here, it's very important, this is your address. So you just put your Solana address. So for me right there, I'll go check my address. I'll go check my address. I got it. That's good. And just passed my address. Just after, you have the share. If you want 100% share, I think you want on your address. So file, save. And we will be good to just generate them. To generate them, it's really easy. You have to type index uh, node, sorry, index.js. If it says that node isn't installed on your computer, you have to install node. So on Google, on the description, install node. So you can see create edition zero, create edition one, edition two. It all arrives in the build folder. You have the images and the JSON. So we see pink, pink one, orange one. Great. Very important for the layers to be in the right orders. Okay, we're good. So what do, we want to, what do we want to do now? We want to take all the JSON files that we have right there, all the PNG files that we have, and we, have, we want to copy them and upload them on the Solana blockchain. So to do that, we go back on the desktop, Ashlabs, Ashlabs Art Engine, go on the build, images, we take them, Create a folder. Oop. I just missed it. We create a folder. We take all the PNGs in a folder. Oh, we got this one wrong. Great. And all the JSON files. Take them and put it in the same folder. So if we go right there, we can see we got the metadata, the JSON, the PNG, all in the same folder. Uh, you can download Metaplex, Metaplex, which is right there. Metaplex version Metaplex. Just go to the code and git clone this uh, this repo. Uh, for now, uh, there is one great video that have been done um, by a, by a mate which is fishes so just go and check the video of, uh, of this guy it's really really good explained uh, if it's not i will make a video later on this um, on this one okay so cheers everyone thanks a lot to have watched this video uh, don't forget to go to the tiny tigers page uh, i have a discord as well if you want some help um, on your different problems that you have uh, to generate your files. So just go to a Twitter and send me a message, go to a Discord, send me a message as well. I'm available for you, so do not hesitate to, to reach us. Have a great day, guys. Bye-bye.